Hey guys, I'm Maya. So today we're going to be talking about page references and the hashtags in Rome. Now, if you don't know what Rome research is, you can go back on our channel and we have multiple videos explaining the basics. Hope you enjoy! First thing I'm going to show you guys is how to create a page. Now, there are two ways that I know how. So the first one is you just, um, actually three ways. So the first one is you go here and so three ways to create create a let's see create a page i go here and the first one is so first one just you write with the flow okay so write with the flow and let's say i today today i created a page called um i don't know flower let's say flower see now what I did here, it might seem a bit confusing, so I'm gonna do it again. So I go here and I go again. Two square brackets, and in Rome it's symmetrical, so it's automatically gonna appear on the other side, and I just write flower there. Boom, so I created this page. Now, a page is basically this big um, group of all these little things that I wrote about flowers. So it's like this group and everything, every time I wrote something about flower, it's always going to be collected in that place, in that page. So if I click on it, click, and here it says, on May 7th, which is today, I created a page called flower. Okay, so if I go to unlinked references, now unlinked references are basically every single time that I wrote, that I wrote the word flower, which is here, the giving tree to bring from home Lego of small pink and brown flowers. And if I want to link it because it's the same thing, I just go link and it puts gray square brackets around it. Okay? Now, um, the second way um, is to um, write to go on all pages. Well, not necessarily. You can see here flower or you can just go directly on the little plus. Okay? Plus and this is a blank page. Now let's say I want to make, um, to create a page called Lego. So I'm gonna write Lego. Oh, I didn't know. So I see, I go here and I press here and it created the page. Now we can also see over here that it just says Lego because this is the page called Lego. So here I can just start writing. So I don't know, um, I really love Lego. Now here, you don't have to put this in square brackets because when you put in square brackets, it's just basically gonna bring it up on this page. And I don't, if it's already on this page, why would I put it to be here and here, okay? So now I'm gonna look for any unlinked references. Whoa, so I do have a lot. I have um, here, I really love Lego, which is this. Then I have, Korean played a Lego gun. So here I can link some things. So I can put them in square brackets. So if I go link, it goes here. Oh, by the way, if you guys want to check this out, it's really cute. Um, then I can go to March 19th, let's say, giving tree, bring home um, Lego. Okay, so I'm going to link it. So now there's square brackets around it, okay? So I'm going to go back to daily notes now. I'm going to use it. I'm going to use Lego. So let's say... Um, Today, I plan on playing some, and square brackets, let go, and press enter. See, so now I'm going to go back on Lego, and it is here. Now, let's say, um, and the third one, actually, is here. So, you go here, and you write, let's say, cloud, and you just press enter, and it says new page, dot, dot cloud and just press enter and it created a new page cloud now let's see for any unlinked references and i do have some okay now i'm going to go back to daily notes and let's say um i want to play some i have to post something on youtube okay so i'm going to do post um uh, the giving tree post lego giving tree on YouTube with Sophia and Corvin, Corvin and on, let's say I'm going to go date picker. So you go slash, no, on, on what day? Let's say next week, next, 
next week, okay? Now, I'm going to show you guys what you can improve with this sentence. So, using page references. So, first of all, I'm going to go here. Now, I'm going to make this as a capital and I'm going to select it and go two square brackets on each side, there and that, okay? And I press here. So that means if I go on, on Lego, here it says May 7th, post Lego giving tree. I'll go back and here you can see um, that there are, there's this sentence is still not that beautiful and Romy, Romish, yeah, Romish. So I'm gonna go here and I'm also gonna put this YouTube in square brackets, square brackets like that. And I also have a page. Now, I'm also going to put uh, Sophia with the hashtag in front of it. And still going to reference the, link, the page because hashtags and um, uh, square brackets are basically the exact same thing. The only difference is um, the appearance. So see if I go in Sophia, I have only hashtags for her. Oh, actually I have one here, which is square brackets. So you see it's the same thing. And I also want to put a date. So I'm not only going to say next week, I want it to appear in the day from next week. So I can just go um, slash and I go date picker. And I see next week, let's say I'm going to put 12. Okay, on May 12. Okay, and the last thing I'm going to improve is I'm going to make it as a to do because I have to do it. To do, there we go. So now look how beautiful and romish the sentence is. Okay, so let's say um, I'm going to go on May 12 in the future and I'm going to see if I have any other things to do. No, on May 12, I only have to post a giving treat uh, with my little brother, my little sister. Okay, and when I do it, I'm just going to click on it. Okay, so yeah, that's about it. Now I'm going to show you my uh, graph overview. So I can just go click on graph overview. Now this is just basically, you can see there's going to be a lot of dots and all these little gray lines in between, which is all the little links, all the links that I've ever created. So if I can even click on them, but I don't, it doesn't do anything. See how many there are? Okay, and I click on this one, and this one is my favorite. I don't know why, it just seems really, really cool. This one, this vertical one, this one. Anyways, so this one, this one um, is my done bullet. Oopsie, kind of zoomed in too much. So this one, connects all of the things that are done. So all the to-dos that I checked and they moved to done. So these are all of the things that I did. And they're connected to a lot of dates because I have to do a lot of things. I'm a good girl. I clean up a lot and do a lot of chores. So, Anyways, <laughs> yeah, that's the graph overview. Now, of course, if you don't have any information about to-dos, you can just go and check out my sister's video and she's gonna explain everything to you guys, okay? So um, that was it for uh, page references. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And um, if you have any questions, just please tell us in the comments and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Hope you liked it, bye.